name, welcome to Wrexham, and how did the move come about for you? Um, I sort of, uh, you know, was made aware um, from the gaffer uh, of the interest, and it was just a matter of sort of uh, speaking to my parent club and, and getting it over the line. I made it uh, known to my gaffer that I was sort of desperate to get away. I looked at the situation and, and where Wrexham were at, and I wanted to definitely be a part of it. And um, fortunately, it happened. It just, you know, didn't get to play that that yeah. game, which was part of, you know, the excitement that fixture coming up. But yeah, ready to go. And obviously, while you didn't get to play that game, you did get at least a look at your teammates. Where do you think you're going to fit into the team? Yeah, I mean, that, that was the um, positive side of the thing. I got to have a look at sort of the way we play and that, and, you know, um, I, I'd feel that I'd fit in that sort of front three, maybe on the right or the left. Um, and, and that formation suits me to the ground. Um, you know, I can offer a lot in that position, and I'm, like I said, um, it was itching to play. Um, mm. But um, it gave me, also gave me a chance to look at the boys, so, um, yeah, looking forward to it. Obviously, it's a step down in terms of divisions, but how important was it to come to a club with ambitions of getting promotion at the end of the season? Yeah, I mean, just before the window shot, I could have gone to one or two football league clubs. Um, it wasn't right for me um, at the time. Uh, you know, I got my head down, ready to go to Swindon. Um, and obviously, uh, the window shot, and I did speak to a couple of clubs in this league, but like I said um, previously, it, it was important for me to go to a club with sort of something to play for. Um, and in terms of, obviously, where they're at, and I know the gaffer well, that helped. Um, and and in terms of being in the future, um, obviously I'm not going to be staying at Swindon, although I've got a year, so I think it fits both parties, um, me to potentially do well here and um, obviously you know, where the club want to be as well. So suppose that's the thing, you said unfortunately you missed out on the chance to play Orion, but nine big games still to come, so a large part of the season to play a part in. Yeah, of course, and like I said, I can't wait to get started, you know, um, I've met, met the boys, you know, uh, briefly at training and, and I was itching to go and I sort of find out about the clearance situation, it's all news to me, I didn't know anything about that. Um, and I would have loved to have played that game, but you know, obviously we've got nine to go, nine big ones, um, and I'm looking forward to being a part of that and um, adding what I can to the party. You've mentioned how you'd slot into the formation during playing on the wings. What can the fans expect from you in terms of the pace, the attack that's going to be coming from that? Yeah, um, I mean, it would just be pace and very direct. Uh, you know, I like to get in behind and you know score goals. Um, like I said, um, bums off seats if you like. <laughs> but uh, yeah. I just want to sort of add that and you know, after watching the game, uh, I feel I'd fit into it nicely and, and, and sort of can be that outlet and take us up the pitch. Thanks so much, Jermaine. Yeah. Good luck. Cheers.